if that was a panther. So it's Monday morning, I didn't really have anything to do this morning, so I was gonna take this time to go head out, find a new trail that I've never done before, and do a trail run. I was debating between going down south where I normally go, or heading out west. I'm actually going west, further west than I normally go, so it's like closer to the west coast of Florida. So it's about another hour drive out there, the sun's coming up. All right, one more quick stop. Uh, so this is a rest stop, but it is one of the coolest rest stops you'll probably ever encounter. It's a mix between rest stop and uh, National Park Museum. I actually wasn't gonna come here first. I was gonna try the second, but it's the first stop on the road. So I'm gonna go run here. It actually looks way cooler than I thought it would. This is called Crew Marsh. So I'm here. I could do a nice big loop. There's some observation deck. Do a nice big loop around there. Crew, Corkscrew Regional Ecosystem Watershed. Hmm. Ooh. Jeez. Ow. Oh. Bit by ants. So it's still summertime. It's still the wet season. All right, let's go. Giant spider web. <laughs> Flatwoods Trail says going back to the car. Alternate Marsh Trail. Let's go for the alternate Marsh Trail. Water is super cool and it's quite refreshing. Original intent was to do a run. Not totally possible right now, but this is still fun. It's still a lot of fun. So I brought headphones. You normally run with headphones, listen to a podcast or audiobook. But like out here, I just wanted to listen more to the sounds, be more immersed in the environment, the sounds of nature. I say I want to be one with nature and listen to nature as I walk and talk to myself holding a camera in my right hand. Well, look at that. A watershed is an area that drains into a river or lake. Wetlands include some of the most productive habitats and ecosystems in the world. So that turned into more of a water slough than a trail run, but it's still a lot of fun. Uh, it was about three and a half miles to like the outer loop. Uh, I'm gonna head down to another site that's a couple miles down the road. Check that place out. So now I'm at the Cypress Dome Trails. Uh, this should be a little bit longer. Hopefully it's not as flooded and I can actually run. I'm here. I can go around this loop. That might come in handy. There, let's do this. This area is definitely drier higher up. 
more flat trails to run bigger. I kind of missed the marsh though. A name like Wild Coffee Trail is a bit hard to resist. The problem with these trails is they're, um, they're service roads. So they're not really trail trails. They're like very wide and kind of a bit boring, to be honest. Just as I was complaining about service roads, this trail is like a legit trail. It's pretty awesome. So far it's been the best part, trail-wise, of the entire trip. Wild coffee for the win. So, a little nerve-wracking. Water is getting a little bit deeper. Hopefully it doesn't get much deeper than this. Alright, I'm at that point now where I'm ready for some dry land. Sometimes I think I'm out. And then, it starts up again. each other in my heart right jacking. So this is like a mixture of the island from Lost, Deliverance, the village, and the final scene of adaptation. This battery's about to die. Found the trail. That was a little nerve-wracking, especially with the bobcat panther thing that I saw. All right, I need to get out of here. So I tracked everything on Gaia between the two hikes, did about seven miles. This wasn't the intent of today. Uh, the intent was more running, didn't do a lot of running, but getting seven miles in with a pack in pretty shitty conditions. Still a win in my book, still a win. Overall, good day, cool new spot in Florida I discovered. One last thing. Honor system. Support your parks. Calling that a day. Time to head back to Miami. Grab some food on the way back. Try to keep it within the zone. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. Sprinkled with nuts, so it's fat blocks and carb blocks. It's part of the zone diet. It's counter for. It's counter for.